I'm Kelly from Pushchair Expert. Since its launch in 2015, the high-end pushchair brand Egg has gone from strength to strength. Becoming an aspirational brand for many parents, influencers and celebs has iconic looks and unique features to match. 2022 sees the launch of the Egg's Edge Stroller. The Egg's Edge is far smaller than the Egg 2, giving you a more compact option. Less features, but also a smaller price tag to match. The XZ is available in four eye-catching colourways. Just Black, which is an independent retailer exclusive, Quartz, Feather and Seagrass. We have Seagrass here, which is a beautiful, earthy, light green with a touch of sage in it. Teamed with a gunmetal chassis, it's simply a stunning option. As we'd expect from Egg, the chassis has a lovely finish to it. The gunmetal really shouts class and style, with the plastics being black with nice detailings. The simple egg logo on the side has a matching gunmetal finish to it. The bit we really like is where the hood joins the chassis, as this fitting has been made to look like an egg. It's this attention to detail that really makes the Egg Z Stroller stand out from some of its competitors. The chassis has a slight curve to it to echo the DNA and style of the Egg 2, so you can tell they're related. The Egg Z is a four-wheel stroller designed for urban living and holidays. The wheels are compact and puncture-proof, made from PU, 18cm at the rear and 15.5cm at the front. Again, the detailing is apparent as the tyres have a unique egg-shaped tread on them. All the wheels are removable for easy washing. There's also all-round suspension and we found the Egg Z to push well through the streets, but also fed pretty well in the park too. We'd have just liked the option to lock the front wheels for rougher terrain. We tested the Egg Z stroller with a newborn and older toddler and the push was very good with both. Between the back wheels, you'll find the brake. Place the ball of your foot in the middle and rock it backwards to lock and forwards to release it. There's a useful visual red and green indicator to ensure you know whether the brake is engaged or not. For a compact stroller, the Egg Z is a decent sized basket. It holds a maximum of three kilos and it's accessible from the front and the rear of the stroller, with an extendable flap at the rear to allow easier access. The basket is quite long and with its design would hold a baguette or two perfectly. There are black flaps on either side to hide and protect the thick elastic which is part of the folding mechanism. Moving to the top of the chassis you'll find the handle, which sits 103cm from the floor. The handle isn't adjustable but we don't envisage this being a problem for most people. On either side you'll find bag hooks, perfect for the egg backpack. The handle is well padded and leather wrapped with hand stitching. The finish is perforated to ensure that you don't get sweaty palms even on the hottest of days and has egg imprinted on it. The finish on the handlebar is echoed on the bumper bar and really adds to the styling of this stroller. One of the first things that you'll notice on the Egg Z is the fabrics, luxurious in finish and design. They're soft to the touch and the seat is really padded. The Egg Z is obviously comfortable as our testing toddler easily fell asleep in it. The fabrics are wipeable and the calf support has a black finish towards the bottom. This is a nice practical touch for dirty little feet. The Egg Z is suitable from birth without the need of a carry cock, cocoon or infant carrier right up to 22 kilos when your little one will probably be walking full time. It's a big plus point that the Egg Z stroller is suitable from birth, so many strollers are only suitable from six months. The harness is a really low setting to cater for those smaller babies. Find that some strollers that are suitable from newborn have a harness that then cuts across the face. The Egg Z also negates this problem with a removable head support. I have to admit that the addition of a cocoon might have been the icing on the cake to offer a cosy place for a newborn to rest. There's a five point harness with three height positions. To alter you do need to re-thread through the slots in the backrest. A no thread harness would have been an easier option for parents but generally you're not doing this every day so it's not a great hardship. Each of the five straps are easily adjustable, even the crotch strap, so you should get a good fit for your little one. Secure your little one in the sea, Egg have used a revolutionary magnetic harness, something we haven't seen from Egg before. To undo the harness, simply squeeze the light grey buttons together. To do the harness up, line up the fore shoulder and waist buckles and align them with the harness. Finally, place the front of the buckle towards the harness and the strong magnet will snap this in place. The comfort pads are included and these are of excellent quality, very padded and soft. At the base of the seat is an adjustable footrest, which has two positions. You adjust this by simply lifting up the hidden paddle located in another material in the centre of the underneath. We love that the Egg Z includes a bumper bar, as this is a must have in the eyes of many parents. The bumper bar is covered in a perforated leatherette finish to match the handlebar. It's gate opening and can be done from either side by squeezing the button located underneath the bar on either side. The Egg Z has a mechanical recline rather than a strap recline, which we're pleased to see as this makes life easier. 
the three recline positions and you simply pull the lever behind the seat to alter the recline. The seat also has a good upright position, a real positive given that toddlers generally don't like to slouch. There's also good clearance between the seat and the hood to help accommodate those taller toddlers. The hood on the XZ is UPF 50 plus, giving your little one both protection and coverage from the sun. There's also a ventilation window at the back which can be accessed by folding up the material and this also acts as a viewing window. We like the touch of the leatherette tab with egg on it. With the hood in its original form, it doesn't give great coverage. Once you unzip to reveal the extension panel, it's much improved. The material at the back of the hood goes all the way down to the seat, even in the fully reclined position to allow your little one to sleep in a protected place away from the elements. Combined with the fact that the edges of the seat are relatively high, we love this protected sleeping space. We also love that the front of the hood is edged with gun metal to match the chassis. Not only does it look good, but it helps to maintain the shape of the hood too. The fold is where the XZ had a tricky task, as the market is full of compact folding strollers. Could they design a gorgeous looking stroller with a seamless fold? Well, we loved the fold. Simply to press the button on the handle and squeeze the trigger. As you push the handle forwards, the XZ stroller will fold all by itself. Folding does not come more simple than this. Once folded, the XZ will also auto lock and self stand. Although compact, it's not the smallest fold, so you're unlikely to get it onto the plane with you. However, this is designed to be a compact stroller rather than a travel stroller. Unfolding is, in theory, just as simple. However, in practice, we find it somewhat cumbersome and almost 10 kilos noise at the lightest. To unlock, you squeeze the trigger on the handle and lift with the bumper bar to flip the wheels out. We can't lie, the fold is amazing, but the unfolding is a little disappointing. There are a number of accessories available with XZ. Generally, we don't really cover these in our reviews, but we decided that both the liner and the changing bag were worth mentioning. The XZ is compatible with the original Egg and Egg 2 liner. We have to admit that we love liners. The liner is reversible, cotton one side for those summer months, and the most soft way fur on the other side for cooler months. The XZ backpack changing bag is available in matching colours and is the same one included with the Egg 2 stroller. When a bag arrives in a dust bag, you have high expectations. There's no denying that this is a lovely looking bag. The top of the bag is a quilted finish, and whilst not exactly the same, it does tie in nicely with the quilted finish on the seat of the XZ. On the front is a metal egg logo, subtle and nicely finished. There are two very well padded straps, meaning carry even fully loaded is comfortable. Both the rear of the bag and the straps are finished in a honeycomb mesh to help weak moisture away. There are also two adjustable stroller hooks to allow you to attach it directly on the chassis of your Egg Z or Egg 2 stroller. The Egg backpack has a double zip to allow us easy entry inside. Inside you'll find a cute egg shaped changing mat with a handy mesh pocket at the bottom. It's just big enough to house a travel pack of wipes and a spare nappy or two. Inside the bag you'll find three pockets, two smaller ones and a larger one. The front pocket is large and is also insulated. We appreciate the fact that this is so large, big enough to house not only a bottle or beaker, but also food when you reach the winning stage. All in all, a great backpack that looks great, but it's also practical. So having put the Egg Z through its paces, what did we really think about the Egg 2's offspring? Quite frankly, it's a stunning looking stroller with a clever fold. Maybe a little heavier than some of its competitors, but the majority of the time you're pushing it and not lifting it. It's a compromise that we are prepared to make as the ride is so comfortable for your little one. The Egg Z is a welcome member to the Egg family. We're convinced that Egg fans are going to love it. We give the Egg Z stroller 4.6 out of 5 stars. Head over to pushtoexpert.com to read our full review.